For most enslaved people in Texas, it was a typical day. They got up, they went to the fields, or picking cotton, or producing sugar, and working just as they always had done. This was two months after the Civil War ended and two and a half years after the Emancipation Proclamation that President Lincoln issued on January 1st of 1863. Although they were fighting for their freedom, although they were still running away and committing acts of day-to-day resistance on plantations, enslaved people were not actually living in freedom. But on that day, June 19th of 1865, General Gordon Granger of the Union Army galloped into Galveston with 2,000 other individuals and came and gave a proclamation. The people of Texas, Granger said, are informed that in accordance with a proclamation from the executive of the United States, slaves are free.